guys, what's up, Dust Matters here, and uh, what do we have here? Uh, what we have here is um, Clay Soldiers. This is a mod that uh, some of you may recognize. Captain Sparkles showed it off. He did a little, like, Minecraft spotlight on it. And, uh, yeah, that's what we got here. So what I've done is I've, if you know what this is, this is my modified Spleef Arena, which I've put down. And I uh, modified it to work with um, Clay Soldiers. So what we have here is we have four different sides. We have the red, green, blue, and yellow. And I've given a uh, equal amount of soldiers to each team. I've given I think like 16 horses, uh, 32 like men with sharpened um, swords, and then just like an extra 16 with nothing at all. Uh, so what we have here is uh, we're just gonna get the start off here. We have a boundary which prevents them from fighting each other. And now if we go up here, we can press it. Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. Hang on, instant mine. Okay, we got that up. So, okay, we got that up. But now we can go up, back up here, and we can watch the uh, mayhem unfold. So let's see who wins. You see, we have people on the torches. Now, there's other things you can add to them, but uh, I didn't want to because it would just ruin the spleef arena. But as you see here now, thanks to the uh, thing, um, they can jump one block up. So they can jump up here and start fighting. So let's see who's winning. Looks like. Blue has like half their army back here. Red has like no one left. Green has. I don't know. Um, yeah, this is quite a cool mod after uh, they're all done fighting. I think they got killed and they got kicked off their horses. Hmm. Uh, after they're all done fighting, I'll show you guys how I set this up. And uh, yeah, so let's see who's winning. Who's winning? Let's go around and just pick all this up. Okay. So yellow seems to be doing pretty good. Blue still has like their entire army. Uh, there's only a couple red soldiers back. Uh, doesn't look like there's any green. Green looks like they're screwed. So yellow and blue are going at it. And from what I found too, blue seems to be the most dominant. Uh, we have these two guys over here. Come on, fight these guys over here. And yeah, yellow screwed. And he's dead. Okay, so yellow and green have lost. Red is still back here. And I'm waiting for this guy to uh, go kill himself. And there he goes. Okay, so blue wins. Yippee. Let's, uh, let's open this up. Do all that. And we'll just, we'll just kill them all. Why not? Okay, they're all dead. So now I will show you guys how I set this uh, arena up. I'm over here. So what we have is we have the lever, which leads to the redstone, which uh, goes down in here. Goes down in here. Goes down this entire path again. And then goes down... Oh, truck. Let me wait. And there we go. Okay, so let's turn light on. Okay. So it goes down in here, and this is the underbelly of what would be the spleef arena. And as you see here, we have the pistons. Now let's uh, go up here. Um, and let's just give ourselves like a torch. Okay, so as you see now, when we go up here, get rid of all this, you see that uh, it's set up, and they can jump one high, so they can jump up here, and then they can jump up here. But this is when the pistons are off, so they're in the down position, and they can easily uh, access it. Mm, you know. uh, now what we do is when we uh, when a current is applied to it, like this, the pistons lift up, lift up, and they can no longer jump over it because this is two blocks high, and they cannot jump that high. So this uh, what this means is that they're pretty much trapped until I act or deactivate it, and then they climb up. Now, as you see here, there's a little area where they can get in, and there is a flaw that they can just walk in here, and when I uh, when I close it, they a few of them can die, but it's really not big of a deal. Uh, what you also notice is there is stone here. Uh, if I go over on the other side, okay, stone. There is stone here, and the reason for this is before, what they would do is they would, hang on, let me just, uh, yeah, do this. 
what they would do is they would just climb through here and they would have no problem and then they end up fighting down here and I end up losing like half the army so that's what I ended up uh, putting the stone there but it's a fairly simple uh, fairly simple setup it does not require that much uh, hard work I did have to use the repeater so I could all get all get all this up but it's fairly simple all I do is just copy one of these over on each of these different sides all of the pistons live up lift up and uh, yeah it's that simple now what we're going to do now is uh, let's close this now I'll just show you from right here if I uh, if I have this I just place it here and you see all of the pistons light up they all light up and uh, they're free to go now this back there we go. Okay, um, let's turn off instant mine. Okay, so let's go back up to the top and out. Um, and let's just show you guys uh, how to set up the armies now. Now, this is on, which is what we don't want. So let's go back down, turn off, turn it was off, let's turn on. And now they can't get out. So what we're going to do is just pick these up, I don't, even though it doesn't really matter. I'll just pick these up. Pick these up. and that's virtually good so let's get rid of all that and then with too many items when you install this mod you get all these little green soldiers and whatnot so we're going to uh... spawn sixty four of these which is uh... four stacks if you're not good at math that's how many it is okay we're gonna spawn actually let's just put these guys down so we have one mm -hmm. Put these guys down for all of them. And they don't do any harm to you, so you can't do any. See, they can't go through there. They can, like, go under there, but they can't escape, which is good. Uh, this is red. Okay. And you know what? Oh, God. I think I killed one. I can pick them back up, and... Okay. You don't want to place too many, because then it just becomes, uh, crazy. So I'm just placing 64 at this time. Okay, so now we have that. Let's uh, get rid of all this again. And now what we're going to do is we're going to spawn 16 horses per color, I guess. So uh, we're down here. We'll spawn these, and the uh, people will automatic or the team will automatically get on the horses. Uh, that horse seems to be very lonely, but it will have a person soon. Okay. Uh, and I did I place two? I placed it. Okay. So we're back here. We'll place some horses over here. And there, and we'll just do that for all, each side. Come on. The annoying thing is that they do take up a lot of area. There, so that you pretty much do have to uh, use or carefully place them. Okay, so now they each have horses and equal amount of players. Now what we want to do is give them each um, sticks, which uh, is acts like a sword to them. We're going to eat, give each of them uh, 32 sticks. What does that sound? 32 sticks sounds good. Okay, so all we have to do for this is drop the sticks, and they will automatically just pick it up. You see them, they have those little sticks in their hand. So they automatically just pick the sticks up. Jump in here. Okay. And again, if you watch Captain Sparkle's uh, video, then you know what to expect. Okay, drop that in there. And let's get that. Now what we want to do also is to add flint which makes the stick sharp pretty much giving them more damage uh... where's the flint 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 oh there it is okay we do the same thing thirty two per and all all we do again is we just drop it in there and they start picking it up and see they have little white tips on the end so uh, that's that i'm gonna go over here do the exact same thing and now the armies are basically equal. Okay. Armies are basically equal now, so they can go do that. We will go back up to the top and uh, let them fight again. Yeah, I mean, it's a very simple mod. It's very fun. Uh, just make it daytime again. It's a lot of fun to play around with. You can have huge armies. Uh, I just don't... It lags it if you have too many. And <laughs> you see the uh, pistons kill quite a bit of people there, but, you know, it happens. This is not a uh, great system, but it is. It works, I guess. Oh, and they're, uh, they're just getting killed. Um, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys want to show, or if you 
guys want me to show you how to install this, leave a comment, leave a like. And I will show you guys how to install this mod. Uh, you do need mod loader. I will put the link to uh, the Minecraft uh, form to Clay Soldiers in the description below. So if you can, if you want to install it yourself, you can go do that. Uh, but other than that, guys, I will see you guys later after these guys uh, stop fighting. Where's the blue? Okay. Let's just get rid of all these guys. Mm. And... Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys later.